Hey guys, Brito here. Welcome back to the Australian Super Truck Series here on Auto Mobilista. Here we are for race number two, Melbourne, Australia. We're going to be following the Australian V8 Supercar Series. So, this is the Melbourne Grand Prix event. We are support category for not only the Formula One, but also for the V8 Supercars. So starting in uh, 26 spot. Ten laps here at Albert Park. It's at Melbourne, Australia. It's part of the support category for the Formula One and V supercars. Oh, bang. Not much line. room. All these guys are still trying to sort themselves out. Clear. Watch your left. Keep right. Good your if they line. had brakes, so I could tell when they're braking or not. Clear left. On your left. It's very, Clear very left. tight, considering how wide the track Clear is. Right. You're on the right. Clear left. Left side. Still there. Hold your line. Still there. Clear left. It's like a big traffic jam on the local freeway. Come on, get out of the corner. Oh, a bit of a slide. Left side, car left. Hold your line. Still there. Keep right. Clear left. Really missed a shift then. Left. Oh, there's a wall there. Keep right. Still there. Clear left. Good round of this fast left right hander. So the next round will be Tasmania, of course, which is going to be interesting in these things. Very, very interesting, to be honest. So up to 5th, we won't quite get 6th gear down through here, but we'll get 6th gear down the front straight. Watch your left. Clear. Oh, very late under brakes. Probably too late. On your right. Clear right. Oh. Yellow flag. Wait for all these guys to come past now. Fling it around. Body parts, not human body parts, but truck body parts. So back to 26 now, so we can run some people down. Oh, don't loop it again. Five seconds off the car ahead, truck ahead, I should say. Deceiving, you think you can go around these corners a lot faster than you actually can in these things. We'll definitely run them down slowly. It's 10 laps around here, so we've got plenty of time to make up some ground. So I'm using my Logitech G29 and my H-Pat shifter. So I keep nearly missing shifts all the time. On your left, left side, hold your line. Still Cut there. the corner a little Clear bit, left. but there's a teammate ahead of us. Same truck, same paint Clear scheme, left. but 
We've got the long nose, he's got the short nose version. Nuts through there. The fifth gear. Hold fifth. Break at the 150. If you guys have auto mobilist and would like the link to the download for this, from the Brock Harvey's done for us. Um, good friend of mine and also a pretty big part of the auto mobilist at Australia Facebook group. We do run a lot of, he does run a lot of series through that. Uh, GT3 series, which you've seen on my channel. Beer Supercars, Formula 3. Um, oh god, there's other ones as well, but. He runs a lot, so if you guys want to try this for yourself, follow the Australian Beer Supercars, then let me know and I'll leave the link in the next video. So we're already up to 18th now, so we're slowly running them down. Oh, I'll cut that corner. I'd like to do some custom paints as well, it'd be pretty cool, but not sure how to do them for auto mobilista. I'd have to YouTube it or Google it or something. on the back of Benavides. That was a shift fifth instead of the third. Sorted it out pretty quick. Watch your right. Oh. Back to fourth gear. Oh, not second, fourth. Get a good run through here. Get past Benavides this time. Without having to take to the grass. On your left. Watch your left. Hold your line. Hold your line. Last of the late breakers. Still there. Oh. Clear left. A few bumps. Oh, they say Robin is racing. These things should be able to take the punishment anyway. Turbo sounds awesome. Good run. I'm sure why well, we get such a good run down the straight and they don't. When they come back under brakes. Look at how wide these things are. He's coming back down the inside. Left way too much room right for him. Clear right. Oh, understeer as well. I think these guys are just banging off each other. Clear. 
It's from the 14, nearly halfway through the field. It's going to be a lengthy race. We're doing two minutes, two and a half minutes per lap. Not a good run. Hold your line. Clear. Left side. Hold your line. Clear. Clear left. On your right. Oh. Clear. You had a bit of a lunge down the inside. Clear right. So I think I'm only running auto clutch and um at low ABS assist as well, so there's no trash control or anything like that. Just when we get on the straight, I'll have a look. I want noise control. There we go again, down the straight. Yep, ABS and clutch, that's it. P10, four laps down. We got it on a five lap race, I think. Coming up from behind of Jardim. A bit of a rub and a bit of a push to make him run a little bit wide. We're up to ninth. Is that right? 12 seconds, 20 seconds ahead? Oh, how? We're going to be lucky to take the win here. Coming up on Pita. Salustiano. where I spun it earlier. Right. For a lunge down the inside. Oh, yeah. oh, just pulled it up. See, and again, I don't know why we're getting such a good run down the straights. Compared to them. I actually wish it just in case. Got the seventh, halfway through. wide maestro the maestro has run wide we definitely probably need to put it up difficulty up a bit higher I think we're on 107 Difficulty, I think. Oh, 
all again. Another good run down through here. slide up through there to help us get through the corner faster. Throw up to six. fun. Six laps down, okay, four to go, 228, the fastest lap. I'm not sure how fast the Formula 1 cars are going here, but we'll be at two laps done to our one. Love the amount of diesel it puts out, or the diesel smoke. I reckon it could put out a little bit more. It'll be double or triple that, it'll be awesome. See, so driving through big plumes of, of smoke. Piano, right ahead, then Reese just up ahead from him as well. I think the steering wheel a bit too hard then. I'm breaking way too early in there, but. Once again, another good run down here. We're both rubbing that fence. Clear. So it's up to fifth. slow to get out of the corner in third gear. It's going to be interesting next round in Tassie with a hairpin. Getting through turns one and two is going to be interesting enough, I think. Another good run. Bump and a half. It's third and second is just up ahead now. First is still a fair way up the road. sure how many laps to do at Tasmania actually, it's only a very short track. Maybe 20 laps I guess. I'd like to limit the videos to about 20 minutes long so you guys aren't getting too bored. Oh, 
blocks that wall again. Running down Gomez and Toddy. So I'd like to be a bit more difficult. Just so we're not getting past so easily, so it's a bit more of a challenge to get through. Especially down these front straights, I don't know why. They're so slow compared to me. They should be full throttle just like I am, so... I don't know why. Of course we just gave them a good shunt. So 12 seconds to the car ahead, the lead up. Look at how tyres are doing. Look pretty good to me. It's 11 seconds to the lead up. Another miss shift from 4th to 5th and then a 4th to 3rd. I can just see him just ahead. So he's 12 seconds up. Dropped it back to nine seconds now. I don't know how accurate that is because it up and down a lot. Oh, a bit too quick through there. Wrong angle. All the above. Gap's falling back out, 11 and a half seconds. Last lap. Last lap, make it count. Your brake temperatures are right on. Oh no. Oh. We might have been able to hold that, but obviously not. Ten seconds ahead still.
Yeah, it's just 12 seconds and it drops really quick, so I don't know. Definitely not going to catch him, but shouldn't be too far behind him. Around the last couple of corners. Oh, wide again. Not going to get the result like we did last event. Get the win. Going down the front straight, last lap. There we go, going to come across the line in second spot. That's it. There we go. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. If you did, smash that like button, leave a comment and let me know if you want to see more of this series. We'll come back next round with the Tasmania event following the various supercars as I said before. If you haven't subscribed yet guys, please do so. It's been Brito's Gaming, thanks for watching. See you again soon.